So this is a great one for teaching shoulder mechanics as we move into the overhead position. Um, it's important to know how to get from A to B and not just practice a great top position or a great setup, but actually glide through that process, understanding the shoulder blades. So we're gonna set up with one foot in front of the other. In this case, we'll go left in front of right. This is just so that we can get a bit of a lean going and still be stable. Have your elbows shoulder width apart and lean into the wall, okay? Nothing special about this, just support your own weight. We're not gonna add any additional cues. Now from here, uh, we're gonna slide the hands up the wall as if you're pressing a weight above your head. But the arms are gonna come out slightly as you press up in a little bit of a Y shape, okay? So leaning into the wall, just enough uh, friction to feel the wall assisting you, but not so much that you actually can't move your hands. And then we're gonna slide up. And then we'll get to a point where we can't reach further with the arms. From here, we're gonna keep the body where it is and just lift the hands off the wall. So the purpose of this lift off is to feel the back of the shoulder working. So we've got the lower trap muscles, the rhomboids, we're flexing the shoulder and we're allowing the shoulder blade to move a little bit inward to create space to do that. But when we're lifting the hands, we don't want to see a compensation through the spine doing movement that the shoulder doesn't have. We want to get true movement from the shoulder. So it's important that you keep this still. So let's do a few reps now so you can see what it looks like. Lean into the wall, elbows on. I'm going to slide up by compressing the weight and then I'm going to lift off at the top. Slide up by compressing the weight, lift off, back on. So a couple things to watch out for, make sure your elbows are straight at the top when you do your lift off. Make sure you don't actually lean away from the wall to lift off, so my whole body isn't moving, it's just my shoulders. And you don't need to really go overboard with reaching on this particular drill. So don't worry about like reaching and rounding into the wall. I just want you to stay upright, lean on it, and imagine pressing the weight, okay? In the most natural, spacious, happy way for your shoulders.